I'm no actor, Simonetti. I'm no playwright, but in vino veritas Diocles. Papa, Bayak, my friend. We were just talking about you. Ah, should I be worried? No, no. Simonides wants me to play myself in a comedy he's written about Leander, the laudable triumph of the luminaries of Cyrene. Ah, oh, catchy title. He'd be the first to admit it's drivel, but we're hoping a festival will restore some goodwill. To that end, I have one last favor to ask. No acting required. <laughs> Leander's villa should return back to the people, but without the deed, that's impossible. The Romans won't let us search Leander's office at the Acropolis. They will let me. I will find it. Bayek, did you hear? I gave birth to an opus. It burst forth from my creative loins. You... Uh... I wrote a play, my dear fellow, of our exploits. O oh, Meander, scourge of Cyrene, I, Heucles, will stop your scurrilous schemes. Ha <laughs> I changed the names, no one will know. <laughs> to draw attention here. Sister! Me too! And non mover! A double was in consummation! Do we look prohibited? A good acquisition in corpore! A deal! Hey, 
For the rarest and most... The deed is yours, Diocles. The people had lost faith in us magistrates. This will restore a lot of it. You will win hearts and minds, Diocles, with actions. Vitruvius is a friend of yours, yes? A visiting merchant said he saw him on the road near the citadel, and he appeared to be in trouble. That architect is a good man. I've heard his public works have revitalized South Sarinega. I would love to meet him in person. Perhaps we can meet at the Oracle of Apollo. I will check on Vitruvius, that rare Roman dreamer. Vitruvius, Diocles told me you were attacked. On my way to the Citadel, some accursed marauders took my manuscript, my life's work, the architecture. These are dangerous times, but I would not take bandits for scholars. I dread to think what they'll do with it. Certainly not appreciate the function and form of the modern approach to architecture. Then I will get it back before they use it for kindling, or worse. Hey, witch!
Guards here are vigilant. Hey, what? Oh. a book saved for posterity knowledge in the wrong hands is a sad waste you found it praise Jupiter they were sad to lose it I'm sure they had already started using it to improve their rat trap. Thank you, my friend. I will dedicate a chapter to you. I am honored. Actually, my friend Diocles is very interested in reading it. I said we would meet him at the Oracle Shrine. A capital idea. I have someone I need to see, and I will join you. I should go and see Praxila, because she should be at this meeting of the great minds of Cyrene. Safe, mother. A moon smiled upon us, my son. He sent us the Magi so that he could bring you back to me. Bayek, I did not think I would see you again. But I heard Flavius is no more. It was a day I had long wished for. But how has it been in Balagre? The Romans are cooperating more now that Melita is gone. <clears throat> we will see about that. And your friend, Krios. I am teaching him the healing arts. But I sent him out a day ago to the East Hills to gather herbs, and he has not returned. I was just about to go look for him. I will find him if you will go to the Oracle Shrine. There's a friend there that would like to see you. Is it? No, I will not dare to hope. I will join you when I find Krios. Oh,
helped me before. I thought you were a dream. You are a friend of Praxilas. You are making a habit of getting into trouble. <laughs> yes. The plan reveals what is in the seed. I will take more care in future. Oh, thank you, Protector. Yes, yes, do you please? I understand your argument, but function should not be the only consideration. What of perfection of form? Beauty for beauty's sake. It is obvious you appreciate that in other spheres, eh, Praxilla? You are making him blush, Vitruvius. You have brought us all together, Bayek. Cyrene's Triumvirate heralds of a new peace for this outpost of Rome. Each thinks his own horizon is the limit of the world, but through you we have found a greater purpose. And Braxila and I are to be married. <laughs> Theocles, I have not said yes yet. If you have a garden and a library, you have everything you need. But now a toast. To Bayek and Cyrene. To peace and order. To love and weddings. Vade in pace, Sarenaeca. So you will come back to Balagre with me? If that is where you want to build our home. You could do a lot of good there. You already have, dear heart. <laughs> <laughs> 